Hello again, campers. Uh, my lathe has taken a knock. I'm afraid uh, my headstock bearing seems to have collapsed. Well, not collapsed. Got very rough. Uh, a few weeks ago, the lathe was performing absolutely marvellously. I thought it was the best thing since sliced bread. And then all of a sudden it seemed I couldn't machine anything. Mild steel, every time I touched the material with any tool it just howled. Chattered but howled, something terrible. So, I decided to uh, have more of a look and I've dismantled it. I've taken the uh, shaft out. Uh, it came out relatively easy and uh, I'll just get the bearing that's affected. Uh, the front taper bearing, this one, uh, what I first noticed was I developed a black streak I've got some pictures I'll put in. As you can see the black streak from the burnt grease running down the front of the machine and uh, the bearing itself was uh, covered in black burnt grease. The rear bearing however was as clean as a whistle and no marks on the race and uh, the bearing itself still had the original uh, lithium gr grease uh, in it. A black streak down the front of the machine and I was running it fairly slowly but you could hear squeaks and odd things and I couldn't find out where it was coming from. I tried feeling for heat, nothing. Uh, in the end I sprayed some WD at the bearing and the RPM of the machine went up. It stopped labouring or was away. And the more I sprayed, the more this black, horrible stuff came out. Uh, and it had occasions, well, I heard uh, a sound similar to that when you've got a wheel bearing got on a car. A bit of a drone, which it didn't have when I first had the machine. It was a droning, moaning sound. Anyway, we've taken the bearing out. And all I can see... There's some wear on, yeah, you can just see the wear on the inner surface there. And under very close inspection, there is wear and marks on the rollers. And as I say, that was the bearing was black as the ace of spades with all the, I suppose, it could be my fault. It could be that I have over adjusted the, the bearing. Um, but it was running really well, the uh, lathe, for many weeks, no problem. And then suddenly I got this problem. Anyway, I've ordered new bearings. I'm having to sit here twiddling my thumbs because I haven't got a lathe. And uh, hopefully tomorrow my new bearings will come and to get them on the shaft because they're an uh, interference fit um, I've decided to go uh, the same as uh, grew in uh, Despicable Me I'm using my freeze ray and I'm hoping to freeze the bearings to get them to go back in easily. They will tap in with a brass drift and also I've got the shaft at this moment in the bottom of the defreeze in the house and hoping it's going to shrink by a nano and I'm going to pop the bearings in the oven and take them up to about 100 degrees which I don't think are going to do them any harm and hopefully they will expand by a nano and uh, thereby have a lovely slip fit on the shaft and I won't have to do any knocking. 
anyway I'll let you know what happens with that but that's where I am at the minute and without a lathe bye for now